All right, you guys. So I filmed a Vlogtober slash Vlogoween video already today, but I received something in the mail a while back, and there was, there was a little bit of an issue with it, so I had to exchange it, and it took a while, but it's here, and I want to share it with you. So we've, we've snuck in another Vlogtober slash Vlogoween video, but it's worth it, because I'm excited for it. Let me preface this by saying, for those of you who have been here for a while, you know we've been talking about this for years, literal years. So a couple of years back, that's when my channel started to see a little bit of growth. My channel is itty bitty, I know, but it started to see at least 10 to 20 new people per month. We started seeing that about a year and a half, two years ago. And at the time, I had a few people who would periodically say, hey, are you ever going to do live video? Do you do live video? And my answer was always an emphatic, absolutely not. You know what? <laughs> Can you see? Okay, so this is what happens. We're, we're gonna go off on a, on a tangent for a second. But I have a dog, right? Every morning, the ritual is, or rather at night and in the morning. So at night, I fix my pillows. In the morning, I light my first incense stick of the day, and I refix the pillows. And then, of course, the dog is like, oh, fresh pillows for me. And I have been pulling out my my personal pillows, the, the ones that feature my artwork, and I've been putting them on my chairs every morning. And today, he decided to hop on one, knock it off. Then he hopped on the other one, knocked it off because he likes to make himself little forts, little pillow forts, and he likes to sneak in behind the pillows. So I took them off the chair, and now they are on the floor. I don't know if you'll even be able to see them on the car. You know what? I'll just show you. I know, I know. We're, we're going to talk about the live video in a second, but... Bear with me here. This is my frazzled, manic brain. So this is my Belle Pipistrelle throw pillow, double-sided, has a zipper, and then I have my Spooklets cutie. I have other ones as well, but these are the ones that I have been putting on my chairs in recent, when did I start it? I started doing it in September. You don't always see them on my chairs though because I, I either put them on my chairs or I put them in my bedroom. But anyway, so this is my Spooklets, the same, double-sided with a zipper. I have a red bubble shop, and in my red bubble shop, I have several designs for pillows and bags and all of that. If I had any editing skills or patience whatsoever, I would insert that, the little, the little blinky noise, the cartoon blinky noise. Oh, my rings will do it for me. Okay. <clears throat> oh, God. Excuse me. <clears throat> I was eating a Ricola, and it's like there's a little shard of it right there. <clears throat> I have a red bubble shop, and I think I just came up with one more video for Vlogtober slash Vlogoween. I should take you guys window shopping in my red bubble shop. Okay, okay, stop, 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 stop. No more talk of the pillows and red bubble. Today we are supposed to be talking about what I got in the mail. I'm gonna go grab it. Wait, before I do that, let me explain. Let me go back to what I was saying earlier. So, people would ask me about doing live videos and it was always an emphatic no. And it's not because I did not want to do it. It's not because I'm shy. It's not because I'm, ooh. It's because, well, two reasons. One, at the time when I was being asked, I didn't have a decent web camera with which to record a live video or broadcast a live video. And I just didn't have the audience. I thought I have at this point 500 to 1,000 people at the time. I can't really remember. I think it was right around. We were teetering at 500, I think. And I thought, statistically speaking, if I have 500 subscribers, typically when you have a view count on your or a subscriber count on your channel about half of those are actually watching your videos and only a teeny tiny fraction of those are within your time zone and an even tinier fraction of those 
are actually willing to watch your live video. So I thought, if I have 500 people, I have maybe 250 people who actually care about my content occasionally, and out of those 250, I probably have about 150 who are in the US, 50 of those in my time zone, and the ones who actually care about my channel, probably about two to three people, right? So I said, no, one day when I reach 3,000 subscribers, I will start playing with the idea of doing lives. So we're gonna give it a go at 3,000, just kinda get our little toesies wet into the live waters and see how it goes. If I have at least five people show up, cool. We will do another live eventually, but for now we're just testing the waters. We are not at 3,000 yet. We're creeping closer, but we are not quite there. But when we start doing live videos, I'm going to, I'm, I, I need to reconfigure the background a little bit because right now you can see my, my dog's crate back here. And the reason that I have it situated so strangely is because I have a window here and I don't want people to be able to see outside my window because stalkers, weirdos, and creeps, no thanks. I mean, we like creeps, I guess, but stalkers and weirdos, we like weirdos too. Okay, but when all three of those combine, then we have an unholy soup. Creepy stalker weirdos, no. We don't like them. So, in preparation for inching closer to the 3,000 subscriber mark, now we get to the good stuff. Now that I've been making you sit through 20 minutes of nonsense, welcome to my channel. Let me show you what we're here for. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? Am I going to try to do this gracefully? Yes. Am I going to succeed? No, absolutely not. But what's this? Neon. You guys know I love neon. Hi. We have a number of neon bats in my apartment all year long. Hi. I'm a neon sign that says live. Check it out. This may be anticlimactic because I had to exchange it because the previous one, there was something wrong with it. And now this one, I didn't even test it before I started this video. So, I mean, we're going to see. Preparation. Preparation is my middle name. The joke is that it's not. This is why I'm ill prepared. Okay. You ready? She's live, baby. Do we like? I absolutely love. So this is going to go in the background of my live videos. So we need to reconfigure this somehow. You know what? I think it's supposed to go like this now that I'm looking at it. Well, you know what? Whatever. Well, I'm concerned about it because when I, you guys know, if you have a Macintosh computer in Apple, it records flipped. It records in mirror image. Shoot! Did I just ruin this entire video? Should I have been showing it to you this way so that when I flip the, di oh my god. Okay, but you get it. It's a cute ass sign that says live. All right. So. This will be in the background of my videos when eventually we reach 3,000 subscribers and we begin doing live videos. This was quite a mess of a video, but this is how it goes around here. So for those of you who have been patiently waiting for live videos, thank you first of all for asking for them and for wanting them, and second, thank you for being patient. My channel is growing very slowly. It just that's just the way it is. You guys know that my personality is not not everyone's preferred cup of poison. So, people are in and out of here regularly. Some people find me, some people leave, and then there's this bizarre phenomenon that every time I mention a goal, whether it's for Etsy shop or it's usually with subscribers, when I say, "Oh, I want to reach X number of subscribers," as soon as those words are uttered from my mouth, I will lose people because it's the people who watch, they watch me because they dislike me 
but they don't realize that they're actually helping me with every time they want, right? But when I explicitly say, oh, there's a there's a benchmark that I'm trying to reach, I want to reach 3,000 subscribers, they think, we still want to watch her videos even though we like her, but we don't want to give her the satisfaction of having our subscribe or our subscription, so unsubscribe. I know you're out there still watching, you weirdo. But anyway, I'm looking forward to it. If you like my channel, you want to participate in lives, and you have not yet subscribed, well, subscribe. What are you doing? Subscribe. Subscribe right now. Hit that button. Smack it. Kiss it. Lick it. Punch it. Do whatever you like. I don't know. I'm not here to judge your kink. But just tap that subscribe button, and I will see you for tomorrow's episode of Vlogtober slash Vlogoween. This was just an interesting little tidbit that I wanted to talk about today because I got it in my mailbox, and I was excited. Okay. I will see you tomorrow. Be bad, be good. I do not give a damn which. Just make sure that you come back in one piece. Everything you need to know will be down below. You know that. I'll see you tomorrow.